My name is Amanda Sams and I'm a senior staff reporter with the Crimson White and we're standing here outside Jenny Chimes with Mr. Mike Largan and he's going to tell us a little bit about the history today. Um, Mr. Largan, when was the Jenny Chimes originally built? Uh, it was built in 1929. Okay. And um, since then, how many times have you had to replace the original system? Uh, it's been replaced twice. Uh, it was replaced right after World War II and uh, then again in 1966 and then well I guess three times because we replaced it in 2008. Um, can you give me a basic description of what the system looks like? Uh, the current system it's 25 cast bronze bells that are upstairs. There's uh, an electronic interface uh, that's hooked to a computer and we also have a keyboard console that the music student can play. Um, when she's not available then our electronic interface can play music or it also keeps the time. Can you tell me why the chimes were built originally? Uh, I think the, the story goes that the student body was worried that Dr. Denny was going to leave and they wanted to do something to try to persuade him to stay so the idea was let's build a sort of a memorial for him in hopes that he would be moved by it and would decide to stay so this is what they did. Do we have any musical selections to look forward to in the coming days? Uh, I think the week of Veterans Day we're gonna have some uh, some patriotic songs playing during the week and uh, maybe a patriotic concert on Veterans Day. I'm not sure they've finalized all the uh, details yet but yes there will be some things. Okay, well that sounds fabulous. Thank you so much. I'm Amanda from the Crimson White.